Қазіргі сабақты бастамас бұрын сілтемедегі слайдты ашып алыңыз. Үшінші сабақ. Prepositional phrases. So what is a prepositional phrase? It's a direction or position words. So like most of them. Uh, I know that in your previous lessons you, um, you have trained prepositions of time or prepositions of place and like this. But today we'll look deeply to the grammar, okay? But uh, in most cases they just uh, describe the direction or position, okay? Here let's look at the examples first. A board as to circle, like through, about, at this part, near to, above, before, down, off, toward, across, across, behind, due to. Uh, okay, I think that you need some explanation, right? So let's uh, look at the most famous ones and uh, tell, I will tell you the meaning of them. For example, about, example. I, I've been talking about the weather. Mm -hmm. Next, above, above means above. So, uh, mm -hmm. yeah, you look at this example. And the next, after, uh, after 2020, like there were some changes, yes, major changes in economy or just as our life, okay, after. Uh, across, across is when you just go across the road from, I guess you know this, due to, due to means because of, so the reason of something. Uh, and others, so you don't need them, just know. Uh, prepositions almost always has a noun following it. Yeah, don't forget this rule, please. This is very crucial for you. Preposition has always noun after it. For example, throughout the living room. Throughout is our preposition. Living room, noun was the scent of fatty crabs that had expired weeks ago. Of preposition, fatty crabs and something like this is our noun following this preposition, okay? Because prepositions describe the noun, they cannot connect nouns and meaning of the sentence. It is why they should be always followed by noun. I put my sister on the diet, on preposition, the diet noun. Hmm? After, it works so well for me. For preposition, me, now, uh, it's now. Uh, so in these examples, the preposition plus noun combinations were underlined. And these prepositions and noun combinations are called prepositional phrases. So it means when you have a preposition and noun after that, this is called prepositional phrase. phrase. Okay. For example, in the first example, preposition is of, noun, fatty crabs, and uh, any attached describe in the phrase that had expired weeks ago, that's a uh, phrase that is describing crabs, right? So that is why. And now let's do some exercises. Here we should cross out all prepositional phrases in the following sentences. Here, Hillary got into the boat for the short trip to Haiti. Okay, mm, let's look. Where is the preposition? Mm -hmm. Yes, I guess you are right. Is this for? The short trip to Haiti is noun and prepositional phrase is for the short trip to Haiti. It means this part is not actually needed. It's like a relative clause here. Next, if you do business with me, you will never get the better end of the deal. 
where is preposition? Of. Of. And the deal is now. The prepositional phrase is of the deal. Hmm? Cross it out. We'll need to see the receipt for the underwear you bought on Monday. Preposition for. And uh, on. Yes? On Monday. Our prepositional phrase is on Monday. Next. I drove by my house to check if the package from Amazon had arrived. Okay. From prepositional phrase Amazon is noun. From Amazon it's prepositional phrase. Next. Number five. The 11 robbers broke into the casino vault with their perfectly executed plan. <laughs> Where is preposition here? Preposition? Yeah, you are right. Into. Into. Hmm? The casino vault is noun and into the casino vault is prepositional phrase. Since the hypothesis of string theory, scientists have been back at the drawing board. Hmm? Where is preposition here? Yes, you were right. It's at. At the drawing board is prepositional phrase. Next. Everything that man creates carries within its seeds of its own destruction. Mm -hmm. Preposition. Of. Its own destruction, now of its own destruction is not needed. Next. Kelvin stuck out the door during the school assembly. Out. Mm -hmm. The door is noun. So out the door is prepositional phrase. Within seconds of hearing about the trip to Antarctica, Charlotte packed the shorts and sunglasses. Where is the preposition? Yeah, preposition is of. Hearing is noun, which is not needed. Number 10. We found Teddy in a broken elevator at a rundown hotel in Thailand. Where is the preposition? At a rundown hotel is phrase, a noun, and together they call prepositional phrase. Mm -hmm. Uh, so, why you may be wondering why did we have this topic kind of like why do we need it actually? Uh, because in the SAT examination, for example, which is really needed when you are, I think that there is a reason why you are learning English language, right? If you want to study abroad, you should really pass the exam called SAT, and here uh, you will like be checked on this topic like you know, in every question. Prepositional phrase is very mm, crucial. Why? Because prepositions uh, with noun, they will, they will call prepositional phrase and without them, the sentence can be existent. So the sentence can exist without them also. Mm -hmm. And uh, for example, the question will ask you to find the redundant part of the sentence and here you will cross out the prepositional phrase. I hope that you got my point and now uh, do the homework and uh, just revise what is that. You can just also redo this exercise and uh, I will attach the book and you, where you can find the whole text. Maybe you will read yourself. Okay.